Hi everyone, welcome back to Chef Shaw's Kitchen and don't forget to subscribe. On today's menu, I'll be doing a breakfast meal, cornmeal pancake and cornmeal porridge. <music> First of all, I'm doing my cornmeal porridge. And for my cornmeal porridge, I'm gonna cook it in some coconut milk. So I have a tin of coconut milk and I have some boiling water here. This is three cups of boiling water. So your water must be boiling. So I had my coconut milk. And I'm gonna stir this a little. So that's it, the milk is melted so I'm gonna add now to my cornmeal some water you never add the, the, the dry cornmeal to your hot water you're gonna be in problem so this is two cups of fine cornmeal and you mix it round get the lumps out so I added maybe a cup and a half of cold water And if it is too thick, all you have to do is add some more water to it. You want to get out all the lumps. So now I'm adding my cornmeal. And if you see, there's no lumps. And when you're adding your cornmeal, you keep on stirring. Keep on stirring. And if, if your cornmeal porridge is too thick, then you can add a little more water. If you want to add a little more cold water, but you keep on stirring when you're adding your cold water. And you don't have to cook it in coconut milk. You can just cook it in, cook it in the plain water. I love my coconut, sorry, my cornmeal porridge, very thick. So I'm just gonna lower the flame and I'm gonna let this cook for half an hour because this is the fine cornmeal. So I'm just gonna let this cook for half an hour. And <clears throat> so remember to cook it under a very low flame. So I'm just gonna let this cook for half an hour. And let it, when it is finished, I'm gonna add my spices. I'm gonna add some nutmeg and some vanilla and sweetened condensed milk to taste. So I'm just gonna let this boil for half an hour. So you can cover the pot. Remember, under a low flame, your lowest burner on your cooker. Whilst my cornmeal porridge is boiling, to save time, I'm gonna make my cornmeal pancakes. So I have a cup and a half of 
self rising flour. I have four tablespoons of cornmeal, one egg, two, tables, two tablespoons of brown sugar, just to sweeten to taste. I have my nutmeg, one teaspoon nutmeg, two teaspoons of vanilla, one egg, and I have some milk here. This is the skim milk and some butter to fry my pancakes in. So I'm gonna have some milk. I'm gonna blend everything together. So I had some milk and I had my flour. my cornmeal some nutmeg my sugar one egg and vanilla I'm gonna let this blend Just gonna whip it up a bit. So my mixture, my mixture is a bit thick. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more milk. into my frying pan and the butter is already melted so I'm doing cornmeal pancake chef Charles way so I'm just gonna let this sit and the bulk when it start getting bubbles all over then i'm gonna flip it on the other side and let it fry so you have to lower your flame to the lowest you can get and let this cook right through now i'm flipping my pancake nice and golden brown So this is doing cornmeal pancake, Chef Shaw's way. Just gonna let this brown on the other side. Then my pancake will be ready for serving. Here is my cornmeal porridge bubbling away. And my pancake almost ready. My porridge is ready for sweetening. So I'm gonna use my condensed milk for sweetening. And I'm adding my vanilla. Two teaspoons of vanilla and a teaspoon of nutmeg. Net loveless spices for your cornmeal porridge. And this is a very delicious porridge with your, the taste of the coconut milk and the vanilla and the nutmeg. Wow, I'm gonna enjoy this.
So when this is finished, you pour it in a bowl and let it cool down for a while. You want to have this warm, not hot. So I'm just gonna let this, I'm gonna turn off my flame and I'm gonna pour my porridge. Here's my breakfast, Chef Shaw's way. Cornmeal porridge with cornmeal pancake, drizzled with maple syrup and strawberry and a cherry on top. This is really a lovely breakfast to have in the morning, especially on the weekends when you have time. So when you do this at home, do it Chef Shaw's way. And don't forget to like, subscribe, click the notification bell and share. See you next week.